The crowd into it early, trying to make life difficult for the Raven offense. Dumped off over the middle. West lunges for a first down. On third and six. Flacco in trouble and sacked back near the 25-yard line. Trey Flowers led the way. Excellent receiver on third down. Brady over the middle and incomplete. And the Ravens start from their own one-yard line. Deep handoff, in trouble, it'll be a safety. Malcolm Brown stuffed the run by Kenneth Dixon. They fake the handoff, wide open, caught. Martellus Bennett, the running back on the right hip of Brady on third down and 20. Tom steps up, zings one toward the end zone over the head of Edelman. With Jimmy Smith in coverage, and Brady very upset. Cade into his helmet, Matt Patricia, three-man rush on third down, and the Ravens have a first down. Kyle Juszczyk, oh, running through the Patriot defense, all the way down to the 36-yard line. Great play by Juszczyk, coming out of the backfield. Number 53, the man I just spoke of, and oh, blew a coverage, and how about this yards after the catch? That's sheer effort and determination. Made 35 straight field goals. They jump the center, and it's blocked by Shea McClellan. McClellan goes over the top of Morgan Cox. That's a clean block. What a play by McClellan. Third down three, Ravens' best third down defense in the league. Brady down the middle to Edelman, first down. And battling Julian Edelman, they finally in the lead. Second and six, a screen for James White. Inside the 10. We're going to take him to the dressing room now. Third and goal, New England. LeGarrette Blunt head down. Charging into the end zone for New England touchdown. Flacco fires and caught. Steve Smith again in 2014. Flacco throws. Nobody looking for the ball. Spread again for the Patriots. Four-man rush. Open receiver. On the move, James White. Chris Hogan, the motion man. Look here at Blunt. Blunt down inside the 15-yard line. Good friends, they coach together in New England. Another blitz brought by Pease. Brady in a traffic touchdown. Malcolm Mitchell. New England crowded the line, then rushed only three. Flacco, deep ball and a double coverage. And it is intercepted. Off Mike Wallace and into the arms of Devin McCourty, who has a lot of running room as he brings it back. McCourty across midfield, still on his feet. Inside the 40 and bang down at the 37 yard line. Instead of starting in Raven territory, New England from its own 23. Brady, right in stride. It's Martellus Bennett with eight minutes to go in the half. Running out of time. Just did get it off to a wide open Malcolm Mitchell. Weaving through the secondary down to the 16 yard line. Third down and six. Over the middle, caught Hogan. Big third down and goal from the two. Nobody near Brady. Still nobody near Brady. Now he's hit, and the ball is intercepted and run out of the end zone by Eric Weddle. Flacco, one-handed catch of the snap. Throws, and a good catch over the shoulder. Here comes Weddle on a blitz. Weddle is right there to take down Brady. But they could go into the locker room with some life in their step if they could score here. On his feet, Kenneth Dixon. McClellan started as if he was going to try it again and backed away. And Tucker right back to where he usually is between the uprights. It's quite possible we're looking at the greatest coach and the greatest quarterback in the history of pro football. Flea flicker, Blunt threw it back. Brady down the middle, on target to Chris Hogan. Like a Raven mantra. Brady to the end zone in traffic and a battle for the ball. Won by Bennett. Touchdown, New England.
Kenneth Dixon. Strong run. He got nine before he got repelled. Jerry Rosberg, the special teams coach. Nope. Cook kicks it low, end over end. And what? Jones, that might have hit his foot. Boy, he's had one catastrophe after another. The Ravens are on it. Whose ball is it? That's Baltimore's ball. Flacco. Into the end zone, caught this time by Waller for a Baltimore touchdown. So many serving so many kids. Great program. Matthew Slater back to the kickoff now for New England. And the ball's out. And the Ravens have it. Another special teams mistake by New England from a pro bowler Slater. And sometimes you wonder if other visiting teams believe they can. Flacco over the middle, caught, retreating, looking for ground. Steve Smith finds ground and almost the first down. Hard to find an open man. There's an open man in the flat. It's Kenneth Dixon with a Baltimore touchdown. Blew the coverage. The one time they blitz, they don't cover the back out of the backfield, and Joe Flacco has Baltimore right back in the game. Play big. By Brady to LeGarrette. One deep throw, far side. Edelman inbounds, yes. Ravens offense, one of the worst in the league on third down. Flacco throws, first down. They're back on their own 24. Five-man rush, didn't really put any pressure on Flacco. The ball floats forever, and it's still caught by <laughs> Brashad Perryman. The fourth quarter, New England blitzes. Flacco in trouble. Flacco is sacked. Back at the 20-yard line. It's a three-point game with 6.35 to go. Tom Brady after the play fake. Deep pass. Man running open. Chris Hogan off to the races. Touchdown, New England. No flags on the play. With five and a half to go. Deep drop, a height spiral on target against Russell Wilson. Flacco throws, good adjustment to the ball, and a juggling catch made by Steve Smith at the 29-yard line. It's still outside of two minutes. 37-yard field goal try, and it is just inside the left upright. Another one that started hooking at the beginning and sliced back just enough. But Baltimore has the two-minute warning and two timeouts. It looks like they are going to onside kick it. Tucker runs over the ball one way, rolls it another way, and never got off the ground. Pretty easy. What a grinder. Oh, perhaps some foreshadowing. Blunt stood up, battling, and he stopped short of the first down. Ravens to jump. They don't, so they give it to Blunt, who puts it in the win column for New England. Very nearly squandered a 20-point lead in the second half, and it would have been just the second time in the history of the franchise they had done that. It's a big win for New England with an eye toward the number one seed and home field advantage through the playoffs in the AFC, and they take another step toward what will be inevitably their eighth consecutive AFC East title.